Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to restore the pin to start option on the context menu in Windows 10. So perhaps you're missing it, this tutorial should hopefully go about resolving it without too much of a hassle here. And you want to go ahead and start by opening up the start button. Just off on the start button one time. Type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match should come back a registry editor. You want to right click on that and then left click on Runner's Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on Yes. Now in the registry editor, before you ever do anything, I would highly suggest that you create a backup of it. So in order to do that, just left click on the File tab, left click on Export, name the files whatever you want, but I would personally suggest naming it the date that you're making the backup. It usually makes the most amount of sense. Select Export Range to All and then save it to an easy to access location on your computer. And you just would click on Save. And then if you ever needed to import it back in, you just would do File Import and navigate over to the file. So pretty straightforward. So once you're done with that, we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by expanding the H key current user folder. So either double click on it or left click on the little arrow next to it to expand the drop down. Do the same thing for the software folder now. Now do the same thing for Microsoft, so expand Microsoft, go down to Windows, expand that one as well, and you can see the path on the top of the screen here, so you can follow along with where we're going through expand policies, and then left click on Explorer, should be something on the right side that says no change start menu, you want to go ahead and right click on that, and then left click on delete, left click on yes to confirm the deletion, once you're done with that, minimize out of that, go back up to the top, and now you want to go expand HK local machine. Exact same thing we did before, so you can see minimizing and maximizing. Just double click or click the little arrow. You want to get back to how it looked originally. And then you want to expand HK local machine. Click the drop down. Going to expand software now. Going to go down to policies. Microsoft. Expand Windows. There should be an Explorer folder down here. On the right side, there should be something that says Locked Start Layout. You want to go ahead and just right click on that, left click on Delete, left click on Yes, close out of here. And now once you're done with that, now you want to open up the Start menu, type in CMD, best match to come back with Command Prompt. You want to right click on that, and then left click on Run as Administrator. If you receive a User Account Control Prompt, you want to left click on Yes. Now in this elevate command line, I'm going to have a command in the description of the video that's going to start with REG, and I want you to copy it, and go up to the top bar of the command prompt window, right click, left click on edit, and then paste it in, hit enter on your keyboard, it should say it succeeded, left click on OK, restart your computer, and that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching, do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.